Yo, what is good YouTube? Saint Sibs back again with another video. Let me just talk to you about why I am making this video on the top 5 reasons you should go to the cinema alone. So basically the other day, I wanted to go watch something. No one else wanted to go watch the movie with me. So I went alone, you know. But when I told people I went alone, it was like a sympathy story. I don't know, people felt sorry for me for doing something that I wanted to do, which is just go and watch a movie. I didn't think it was that big of a deal. And it just made me think, do a few of you lot think that's a big deal? Do a few of you lot actually just, you know, not go and watch a movie or not do something just because other people aren't doing it with you? So here is the top five reasons why I go to the cinema alone and why you should do it as well. Well, number one for me basically is pretty much just something that might be just for me. But I like both armrests. And when I'm going with someone else to the cinemas, there's always the argument on who gets the other armrest because when you sit next to each other, you know, you can't just go like that. There's no space for two people. I don't know how most cinemas haven't actually just made space for two people on the armrest, but yeah. Number two would be added costs. Well, most of the time when going to the cinema, it's seen as a date thing. I've never understood this myself and that's going to be on to number three. When you do go to the cinema with, I don't know, a girlfriend or a date or your missus, whatever, your mister, I don't know. Whenever you do go to the cinema with them, it always adds up. I mean, going to the cinema alone, I just go and buy a ticket. I don't need to buy the drinks, I don't need to buy the popcorn, the nachos, etc. I just go watch a movie, I leave the movie, I go home. There's no added costs. But when you go to the cinema on a date, there is your ticket, there is their ticket. Unless, unless you go on a Tuesday or Wednesday, in which, you know, you can do Meerkat Wednesdays, Meerkat Tuesdays, which is buy and get them free. Stay tuned to the end of the video to find out how I do that, because I'm just going to show you. But, yeah, unless you're doing the buy and get them free offer, you have to buy your ticket, you have to buy their ticket. That's already about £20. Then you got the popcorn, then you got the drinks, and, you know, you have to do all that stuff as well, because I want popcorn, I want drinks and all that crap. And as the guy, it's stereotypical, but you usually do end up paying, so... Going to the cinema and forking out 40, 50 pounds is not a thing for me, it's so expensive. Number three would be sitting in silence. Don't you hate, or you, if you don't hate this, you are the person that does it. Ugh. Do you hate when you're sitting in the cinema and there is someone next to you talking to you? Who's this person? Why are they doing this? Oh, what happens at the end of the movie? It's like, bruh, be quiet and let me watch my damn movie. You don't have to plan it around anyone else. For me personally, it's like, a, is anyone down to go watch this movie? No? Okay, I'd go to watch the movie alone. I can go whenever I want to go. I can watch whatever movie I want to watch. And yeah, I can go at night time, I can go in the morning, I can go next week, next month. Whenever I want to go, it never stops me from having to watch something that I really wanted to watch. It's my time, I'm sitting there and talking about my time. This is the fifth and final thing I have to say, alone time. It's important to me to get my alone time because continuously being surrounded by people isn't healthy. I think once in a while you need to be alone and going to the cinema and doing something like watching a movie is getting that alone time that I think everyone needs. You can clear your mind, you're doing something, you're just watching a movie. It's not stressful, you don't have to think too much, you just sit there, you watch the movie and you enjoy it, unless it's really shit. But again, because it's your alone time and if you think a movie's shit, you can just walk out straight away as well. And this is moving on to why I've made this video as well. I think a lot of people think that going to watch the movie alone is a big deal. And I put this on my social media, I put this on my Instagram, my Snapchat, saying, what do you think of people that go watch a movie alone? And I got a lot of answers like, People that go watch the movies alone are brave. What do you mean by brave? Like they want to go watch a movie, their friends are not on it to watch a movie. Why do they not go to the movies? It's because they're not brave enough, because they think that they're going to be shunned as that weirdo in the cinemas. But personally, no one cares. Once the lights go off in the cinema and once it's just you, the movies, everyone around you does not care if you watch a movie alone. No, I mean, if you want to go watch a movie alone, I am going to tell you how to do it right now for all you people that think I'm brave for watching a movie alone or sad for watching a movie alone or anything. How do you watch a movie alone? Let me explain to you right now. You go up to the ticket machine or you go to the counter where they sell the popcorn, etc. and you go to them. Excuse me, can I get a ticket for... You sit down and you watch the movie. It's not that difficult. Saint Sims, this is how you watch a movie alone. But apart from that, let me show you right now how to get Meerkat Tuesdays and Wednesdays 
First of all, download the Meerkat Movies app because that's the most important thing. Then you just have to pretty much just register to compare a market, get some cheap insurance. I got insurance for going to London for the day. It cost me about £12. They activate this to your login details and pretty much for a whole year, you've got two for one vouchers. But apart from that, Saint Sibs, I hope you enjoyed this video. Smash the like button, subscribe. Why am I being so loud today? I don't know, but I want to be, okay? Anyway, since I hope you enjoyed this video, uh, yeah, bye-bye.